I would like to share an important information today about uterine fibroids. As you all women are aware that every fifth woman right now suffers from fibroids. The fibroids is actually a benign condition which is usually more than 90% non-malignant or non-cancerous. But because it does not have any symptoms, it can grow to a very large size, as large as 1000 grams also. What does it cause? Whenever the fibroids are increasing, usually it can cause a high kind of a bleeding problem that is called as menorrhagia or heavy menstrual cycle with lot of pain and passing clots during the menses. The second complaint usually patients have is because of the pressure of the fibroid which is putting on the urinary bladder or the rectum if it is situated on the backward area. In both these cases, the pressure symptoms makes the patient very uncomfortable and then on sonography or MRI, the diagnosis of the fibroid is confirmed. Once the diagnosis is done, the criteria for surgery you must remember unless it is more than 5 cm fibroid, unless it is impinging on the fallopian tubes and causing the problems of infertility or if it is going inside towards the endometrial cavity, the fibroids need not be removed. One more important information is, unless you are close to the menopausal age, which is around 50 years, you need not remove the uterus for the problems of the fibroids. So the hysterectomy is not required in all the cases. In fact, most of the cases, we are always conservating the uterus and only removing the fibroids, which is called myomectomy. The modality of the surgery can be an open surgery or a conventional surgery, laparoscopic surgery, and the best modality is the robotic assisted surgery.